In 2011, the government commissioned a report called the National Strategy for Higher Education to 2030. This is often referred to as the Hunt Report. The report was to look at four main areas. New ways of learning for students, increased research, funding education, and most importantly, structural changes in the higher education system. One of the main recommendations of the report was the clustering of regional colleges and the development of a technological university. Internationally, a technological university is a higher education institution that operates in an environment that is specifically focused on technology and its application. A TU would therefore have the academic quality level of a university with an ethos on technology that the institutes of technology are so proud of. DIT, IT Blanchardstown and IT Tala signed a Memorandum of Understanding for the Technological University of Dublin Alliance. So why would they want to do that? DIT, ITT and ITB have always been proud of their Institute of Technology status. However, they realised it was causing some problems. Other countries don't have Institutes of Technologies, so it could be hard for IT graduates to transfer to international universities. Also, it was unnecessarily difficult for IT graduates to identify what level they have studied to international employers. Many job applications ask what university you attended and IT graduates had to then explain the whole system. As well as that, it made perfect sense to pool the resources of the three existing colleges to benefit all of their students. As the Technological University is a new type of college, it required new legislation. And this is when the Technological University Act began its journey. The TU Act was delayed by the arrival of the general election, but at Easter 2018, the government formally accepted the TU Bill and it became an official act, paving the way for other colleges to apply for Technological University designation. From there, the Alliance formally applied for designation and the application began. In July 2018, the Taoiseach, Leo Varadkar, announced the decision to approve the establishment of the Technological University Dublin during a visit to Grange Gorman. TU Dublin formally came into existence on the 1st of January 2019 and at the same time, DIT, ITB and ITT ceased to exist. On a day-to-day -day level, nothing changed. Students were still on the same courses with the same lecturers and eating in the same canteen but now they graduate as a technological university graduate.